Good morning children. In this video, we are going to study what is potential energy. To understand potential energy, let us take few examples. What happens when you compress a spring and release? You will find it jumps. From where does it get energy? When you compress it, its shape changes and due to change in its shape, some energy is stored in that spring at potential energy. So, energy possessed by a compressed spring or the energy possessed by a stretched spring is potential energy. Similarly, when you take any object to a height, to a certain height, Due to its change in position, it possesses some energy. It is also called potential energy. Means, potential energy is the energy possessed by a body due to change in its shape or due to change in its position. Now, potential energy can be classified as elastic potential energy and gravitational potential energy. Now what is elastic potential energy? So the compressed or stretched spring has elastic potential energy. On the other hand, the object which is raised to a height such as a raised hammer or the water that is raised to a height or water that is stored in very high dams, they possess a different type of potential energy that is known as gravitational potential energy. So, energy possessed by this object, by this stone or by this ball, anything has gravitational potential energy. Gravitational The rubber band which is stretched due to change in its shape, it has elastic potential energy. The hammer which is raised by you to hit on a nail has gravitational potential energy due to change in its height, due to change in its position. So what we have read, potential energy is the energy possessed by a body due to its shape and position. Now, potential energy can be classified as elastic potential energy and gravitational potential energy. What is elastic potential energy? Energy possessed by a body due to change in its shape. What is gravitational potential energy? The energy possessed by a body due to change in its position. Okay, children, in this video, we have read what is potential energy, what is gravitational potential energy, what is elastic potential energy. In the next video, we shall see an expression, a mathematical expression for calculating gravitational potential energy. That's all in this video. Thank you.